there are teams of physicists around the world pushing the envelope of quantum mechanics, coming up with wondrous inventions. And I just want to finish up here with one of those inventions. So I'd like to bring in what is known as quantum levitation. You will only know of this if you are a YouTube junkie because it's having its first public demonstration in the United States here at the World Science Festival. Let me bring in one of the inventors of this demonstration, Dr. Boaz Almog, who's coming to us. from Tel Aviv University, the Superconductivity Group with Professor Deutscher. And what Boaz is going to do here, he has a disk which he's had in liquid nitrogen over here, makes it very cold. And when that disk gets very cold, it becomes a superconductor. And when you apply quantum mechanics to a superconductor in the vicinity of a magnet, it says that the magnetic lines of force get quantized into little tubes, little tentacles that grab hold of that superconducting disk. Look at that. It's sitting there in a stable position. Even if he turns this thing upside down, it's just locked into place. Can you change the angle on that guy sitting up top? Look at that. It just floats there in midair. Now, this magnet over here is a circular magnet. So that has a constant flux around the circumference. So now you can spin the object. And again, it's just locked into place by these quantum threads, these quantum tentacles. And if he now takes this and puts this on this circular track, there's now a magnetic track in the shape of a circle. And again, the flux is constant along the track. So if you let this go, <laughs> is that amazing or what? <laughs> so, so now if he, he can actually take this track, flip it upside down, and you can have this little disk actually hover underneath the track. Again, the track is just gripping it with these quantum tentacles. So let's see if that one goes. Look at it, just hovering underneath, sort of like a little flying saucer as it goes around the track.